A really great marketing tool, recruiting tool, is a shirt. I can't tell you how many times I go in to a gas station wearing this shirt and people will ask about being a driver, you know, they'll ask questions. And so it's a very big marketing tool. It becomes a recruiting tool to sponsor other drivers and use your referral code and with your referral code you have a responsibility to train and coach and motivate and help them become successful within their first 30 days so using other people's referral codes when you sign up for other gigs is very important because you will make more money by using somebody's referral code by gaining their knowledge and the mistakes they made whether it's Instacart or Uber or Lyft somebody that has 7,000 rides or hundreds of deliveries will give you knowledge when you use their referral code and then when you've gained that knowledge you want to be moving over to the S side of the quadrant I mean sorry moving over to the B side of the quadrant as a business owner and not just being self-employed and make money when you're not behind the wheel with your referral business and of course the more gigs you have the more referrals you can acquire um, tips so yeah the shirt is a recruiting tool it also helps with tips because it shows pride in your business um, so let's talk about tips a lot of people complain that you don't get tips I get not tips 90% of the time 90% of the time I'm getting tips I just got a $5 tip so things that'll help with tips the shirt your appearance which of course I'm not doing today very well uh, your appearance tips tip jar you want to have a tip jar it it brings up the topic these amazing diamond floor mats they can get from diamondcarmats.com and then the freebird app um, the Freebird app, you explain to them, you can go to my website, thesimplegig.com, and click on Free Rides and watch that video and download that and use that. So with the Freebird app, you could be making an additional, potentially an additional $5 per ride. You can consider that a tip. Tip box brings up the subject. Hey, we work for tips. I mean, you're replacing your car every two years if you do this full time. You're, you're, there's a lot of dead miles, especially right now with this, with the way things are right now. Um, and in, in the area, in, in this area, in Ogden, Utah, there's a lot of dead miles that you put on your car where you're just running miles that you're not getting paid for. Uh, so I put 80,000 miles on this car in the last 12 months. So basically every two years you got to be buying a new car. So you work for tips. And having a tip jar not only subconsciously says, I work for tips, you know, I expect tips, and a cash box there. If you work nights, the cash box, I, this, this tip box has glowing red light, and it just attracts attention, and people want to put money in there when they're drunk, you know, that kind of thing. So your shirt and appearance shows pride which means tips, the tip box helps you with tips, the Freebird app helps you with tips, um, your floor mats, use code Uber15 at diamondcarmats.com and custom make these floor mats. The floor mats save you in time in vacuuming too, so the cleanliness of your car of course also helps with tips, and of course your conversation or their lack of will help you with your tips and educating them about the thing about being an uber driver and telling them 
how it works in educating I find that they really appreciate it oh I didn't know that wow you didn't know where you were going until you picked me up that's crazy and they really appreciate it and these things the conversation and educating them in the conversation about it and telling them about your other gigs like Instacart or whatever um, yeah those things that'll help you with tips my point in this video is I make 90% of the time I get tips. I am shocked when people are on Facebook or these different chat groups talking about how they don't, most people don't tip. 90% of my passengers tip and they tip well. 50% of their fare is, is a fair tip on a short ride. Now on a long ride, 50% would is not, you know, but short rides, 50% because most of our income from the apps has to be going to replace in your car you end up far from home you're going to be eating out you're you know getting gas every two days rock chips you're replacing the windshield you're getting an expensive synthetic oil change every month tires every three months probably and then before you know it you got a hundred thousand miles on your car you could get 200,000 miles out of it but then it's time so if you're like me 80,000 miles a year you're buying a new car every two years basically so that's tips